Hello everyone, I'm Dr. Nathan Newman. I'm here with, Holland, uh, with Yolanda Halston, our um, celebrity makeup artist. Um, we're here in our Beverly Hills office, surrounded by my uh, staff. And we're going to demonstrate today um, the n new extension of the Luminous Skin Care product, which goes very well with the new NV product line. Uh, that is an amazing product line that uh, we're going to introduce you today and show you how to use it and how you can benefit from it. So, um, as you know, the products that we have are based on our stem cell technology, the APT200. Uh, the serum, which contains the most amount of the APT200, um, is the first product that should go on the skin. She's already washed her face and we're going to apply the serum followed by the moisturizer. Once we do that, we're gonna, I'm gonna ask Yolanda to come and demonstrate to us and explain to us how to apply the NV products. Um, so we have two demonstrations today on two different kinds of skin color so you can see the difference on how we can apply this to every skin color of every skin type and um, how everyone can benefit from it. So, and if you have any questions, please shoot us and we'll try to answer them as we go along. So, first thing we do is the serum. We just take a little bit of the serum and we apply it. And then, we let it dry a little bit. And then we're going to put on the next one is the Daily Moisturizing Complex because it's the day here in Los Angeles and Beverly Hills and we want to make sure she gets her sun protection during the day. If it was at night, we would use the uh, night cream and once we apply that and we let that absorb, um, then we're going to apply the Envy products on there. Feels good? Yolanda. Yes. Come join us in, in the conversation, please. Okay. Well, um, what I like to do when I apply the moisturizer is that you want to actually let it soak in about the same amount of time that you would take to brush your teeth, uh, about two to three minutes, and that way it's fully absorbed into the skin and it has a chance to penetrate. But also, if you put your, your, uh, your cosmetic products over the top of the, of the uh, skin before the moisturizer has soaked in, then it, it, it will cause the uh, foundation to float and then it will come off easily. So you want to make sure that it's fully absorbed into the skin. Very important. Very important. I'm going to trade places with yes, you. Yes, please. And before we start with actually applying it, let's describe and introduce each part of the MB products. Okay, so we have um, three products that we're going to use. Um, the first is the primer. And the primer is actually a very important product because as you know, around the um, eyes and the lip, skin is very um, soft and delicate. And then the skin that's on your cheeks and on your neck and on your decollete and your forehead have a little bit more texture. So the primer is actually going to even out that skin tone and give a very soft, um, even feeling, um, as well as the, um, the fact that the, the reason that most people use primers is to um, fill the fine lines and pores and create a very smooth texture. So. The most important thing you want to remember about this product is to always shake it well. You want to shake it because there's a, a lot of water in there with the APT200 and the vitamins and botanicals and you want to mix those all together so that uh, when you do spray it, you get a nice even application. And that's true for most cosmetic products. You want, actually want to mix it because things tend to settle out. So exactly. all creams and moisturizers that you try to use it's always a good idea to shake it first. Exactly, and this product actually does have a micronized titanium dioxide in there that will um, help with um, the evenness of the skin tone. Um, it will definitely, it's very clear, um, but you wanna just pretend like it's water. And if you do that, you can't make a mistake with it because if you were to spray water this close to your face, you're gonna get wet. If you spray it too far back, it's not gonna go where you want it. So, just right in a 90 degree angle where it feels nice and comfortable, pretend like it's water, and then you're gonna do just a little tiny zigzag right down the center of the face. So just make sure you're soaked in, that's perfect. So close your eyes, 
one quick mist, just like that. I literally just primed her entire face, including her eyebrows, which will allow the powder that you've put in to fill in your brows. It'll give it something to stick to. It goes onto your lashes, onto your lips. It'll help all of your products stay on longer, last longer and go on more smoothly. If you have very dry skin, you can also layer this product. So if you live in a high altitude or in the desert, you can use uh, as, as many layers as you want to create that smooth surface. But she has nice smooth skin already, so I'm just gonna use one layer. And the whole idea of this uh, combination of the APT200 with the Luminous line with the APT200 being in the Envy product is to do that layering. Because as we layer it, it allows for better penetration and longer lasting throughout the day. So you get an even uh, coverage over the skin and you're gonna have the benefits that will improve and rejuvenate the skin throughout the entire day. Exactly. So once again, you're gonna shake. I actually use this product. This is our foundation perfecting mist. So I actually use it as my concealer too. You know, most concealers have oil in them and then you have to powder them, otherwise they will gather and collect in the lines. Whereas with this, as soon as you apply it, it takes just a few seconds for it to dry and then you don't have to powder it. So then it doesn't add to that drying, aging process where that product will stick into the pores and um, look cakey. So and that's I'm a very important thing that we're doing, yes. Oh. I'm gonna spray a little creamy round circle. That's what it should look like. If it looks too watery or if it looks too um, thick, there is a stem that goes down to the bottom of the can. When you shake it, what's in that stem does not get a chance to mix in with the rest. So you just wanna spray it until it looks like that. Then I'm gonna use my ring finger. That way I'm not gonna to pull too, um, too much on the skin. I'm gonna use this as concealer. Go ahead and look up for me. So I'm just gonna tap it very gently underneath the eyes. And I do this first because I like to actually conceal the little things that maybe need a little bit more coverage, and that way I don't overspray the entire face just to cover up one little thing. So I'm gonna go around the corners of the nose. Sometimes you get a little bit more redness there. And if you have any uh, blemishes or spots that you wanna cover, you wanna do that first. So I'm just gonna go around the cat. And what I'm doing here is I'm creating a highlight right through this V area, and that's gonna give you a nice brightness under the eyes. Again, I'm gonna tap, now like I said, this it's all about layering. So when you are using this as a concealer under your eyes, you're getting not only the color improvement and that instant gratification that you want, but you're also getting a treatment around your eyes with those vitamins, botanicals, and the APT. Now look a little bit. And I like regular makeup where you keep putting on your skin and putting it back into your makeup and putting it back and rubbing it on and clogging your pores and putting all that bacteria and all the dirt back onto the skin, this doesn't do that. It allows it, the skin to breathe and mm -hmm. prevents all the bacteria to get onto the skin. So it's very aesthetically pleasing and is also very hygienic. That is probably one of the most important things to me is that not only are you, you, you giving yourself a treatment um, nothing can get in there to contaminate. So this product will, you know, a lot of people are worried about makeup causing them to break out. There's nothing in this that will cause you to break out. And for the same reason that nothing can get in, nothing can get out either. So there's no evaporation. That means the APT200, the water, the vitamin A, the vitamin E, the vitamin D that are in there that are good and healthy for your skin are locked inside so that every time you spray your face, you get first time fresh. And I love that because then you get the full benefit whether it's the first time you spray or the last time you spray. So I'm gonna have you just turn to the side here and close your eyes and you're gonna do one quick mist right down the center. Just like that. It is so fast, so easy, and um, you could be done depending on the amount of coverage that you want. Now I always wipe it off the brows, give it a few seconds, just take it right off the brows and then you're just gonna press it in and blend. Just like that. Now, you can layer this to get the desired coverage that you want. So if you want the coverage of a tinted moisturizer or just a very light coverage, one quick mist is all you need. If you want the coverage of a cream or a powder foundation where you get a little bit more coverage, you're going to just add the layers as needed. So you don't want to overspray initially 
I always say less is more. I want people to look at me and say my skin is beautiful, not my makeup is beautiful. So this is about treating the skin. This is about um, having that instant, flawless, airbrush perfection. So you get the long-term benefit of the vitamins botanicals, and then you get the instant glow, the instant gratification. Yeah, if I look at it, I wouldn't know she has makeup on her. She looks very, very natural. Just beautiful and, and natural skin. This product is wear resistant and it's water resistant. So you can be in extreme humid clim climates. You can swim in this all day. You can use your, your sunscreen, daily moisturizer, and then put this over the top and go to the beach and you're protected. So um, it's very important. So then I'm gonna go ahead and just add a little bit more, just right where on her cheeks where she might need a little bit more coverage so you can see the difference. Go ahead and close your eyes. One quick mist, just like that. And then you could come in and see side to side how you get a little bit more coverage from one side to the other. So turn this way, turn this way. Oh, wow. So you can see that as you layer it, you're going to get that little bit of extra protection, that little bit of extra coverage. So it doesn't matter whether you are 16 and um, wanting to cover you know, blemishes or whether you're 65 and not wanting it to settle into any creases. You can wear this product. Um, I think the younger generation likes the coolness of the technology of the airbrush, but ultimately it's all about the results. Yes. So next product we're gonna use, this is my, I do not leave the house without this on my skin. This is a bronzer. The bronzer is um, about the color of a warm caramel skin tone, like a Beyonce uh, skin tone. Um, it's uh, a golden glow and so you can use this from the lightest skin all the way to the darkest skin we have one shade so from the from the lightest skin like a Kate Blanchett very very pale all the way up to someone that's maybe Jennifer Lopez Beyonce um, this is going to be your bronzer that's going to give you that warm golden glow anyone that's darker than um, then like a seven or an eight is going to get a highlight from it. So everybody can use it and get benefit from it. So I actually spray it right down the center of my face, but I'm going to show you around the outside edges so that you can see if you just make a little circle around the outside of your face, you actually will get a beautiful contour. So close your eyes. So I'm going to go across the forehead and then down the sides, just like that. And you're going to get a warm golden glow that in the, in the um, office here, it's very subtle. It's a pearl shimmer, but it actually is, um, it's very subtle so that you can wear it in the office, you can wear it in your day to day, and it doesn't look like too much, but when you go into the sunlight, or if you have your picture taken on your high definition camera, you're gonna get that beautiful warm glow. So what about people who don't, you know, different places in the world, they, they wanna have either bronze looking, or they wanna look non, and, and, and look wider. Yes. So, so what about those uh, places? Well, um, we do have a new product that was just launched in, um, in Hong Kong. Um, it's not available here yet, but it will be available. And it gives you the same sort of accents that the bronzer does, but it's a, it's a pearl. So you'll get that beautiful glow that comes from underneath the foundation, underneath the skin. You can wear it under your foundation or you could wear it over the top and do the um, the special effects like the strobing where you go around the corners of the eyes you can use it with a brush or a sponge or with your fingers I like to use my fingers because I like the warmth um, how it just melts the product right into the skin um, but a lot of people like to use a brush there's no rules with this product um, you can fit it into your normal routine you get the, obviously the airbrush effect when you spray it directly on the skin, but you certainly can spray it onto your sponge, you can spray it onto your hand, like I did for the concealer, and um, fit it into your routine. Looks great, look at that. Great, wonderful. So I'm gonna take this off so you can get... Can I get a mirror for her? So you can look and get a reaction. And I just wanna point out, you see that it's a spray. This is a white cloth. I always like to show this yeah. because there's very little overspray. The product really does go right to where you spray it. Um, obviously, if you have very light hair or very dark hair, it is 
a good choice to um, use the the um, the headbands or I just throw my hair up into a towel um, if you're already dressed just throw a towel over your shoulders but as you can see there's very little overspray um, you don't get fallout like you do with the okay. mineral powders it's beautiful do you like it really nice thank yes. you <laughs> Excellent. So, can we, should we do the next model? Thank you so much. I love that. Yes. Thank you. Thank you. You're great. You look great. <laughs> so, our next model. Come on in, please. Hi. Hi. Hi there. Have a seat. Obviously, you can tell from the clothes she, she works for me. <laughs> <laughs> so, uh, once again, do you have moisturizer on yet, or do we need to apply that? I do not. Okay. So I'll go ahead and apply your serum and your moisturizer. Um, as you can see, I'm draping her with the towels once again. Um, once you get used to the spray um, and you, you know uh, right where it's gonna go, and you can feel where it's going. I, um, I actually... I got you the fresh one. Just pressing this in with my fingers gently. And I'm going to give it a few uh, seconds to let it soak in, absorb into the skin, and dry. And it's very important for all the uh, products that we're putting on the skin to actually let them absorb. You don't want to just put it on and let it sit. You want to actually let it get soaked into the skin. Mm -hmm. It's a very important part of skin care. And I always take what's left on my fingers and I put it on the backs of my hand. <laughs> or on my neck. <laughs> and then? And then we're going to use the Daytime SPF 30. And once again, I'm just going to press that into her skin. I always uh, take care to use my outside fingers and not use my, my pointer that's too strong because I don't want to pull too much. We're going to let that soak in, once again, about the same amount of time as it takes to brush your teeth. Um, just because, like you were saying, you want to let it fully absorb into the skin so that when you do apply your cosmetic products, that they don't float. Um, this product is a long-wearing product. It will stay on until you remove it with your gentle um, Luminous Cleanser. But um, it, will, it will not come off if you prepare it properly. And that's, the, that's a really important thing to remember is that, like you said, we're adding layers. So the, the serum is going to penetrate very deep into the, into the uh, depth of the skin. Then you're going to put your moisturizer on. That's going to moisturize the surface of the skin and penetrate. And then now you're going to add your primer. And your primer is a very important product. It, uh, this is really five products in one because you know, so many people are using a single product for every single thing. Lashes, lash builder, and lip primer, and skin primer, and eyeshadow primers. You get all of those with one two-second spray. So I think that that's really um, a benefit. And it has the typical function of a primer where um, it fills the fine lines and pores, and it um, prepares the skin for the rest of the cos cosmetic products you're going to apply. So maybe turn just towards me this way so you can see the distance. This is the distance, about where you would spray your face with water. Now, she obviously has very dark hair. She has earrings on. So I don't want to do this because I'm going to be wasting a lot of product. I'm going to be spraying here, but also it's going to go all on the outside. So I just want to do a little tiny zigzag right down the center, just like I'm spraying the face with water. One quick mist. That's it. Whoa. That's all you need. And how did that feel? It's good. Yeah, it's, it's refreshing. refreshing. <laughs> it is refreshing. I have people that keep theirs in the in the fr refrigerator, actually, because they spray it on and they get that cool, cooling feeling. So now, I'm going to do a little bit different of an application with you. This is your 8. I also need to have the 9. Um, I don't think I brought that up here. So I'm going to use, um, for, um, for this demonstration, I'm going to use two shades. I'm going to use the 8, which is our second to darkest color, 
and I'm going to use the nine. So once you get over a level six, which is about Jennifer Lopez skin tone, there's not enough white in the product that's going to add the brightness under the eye. So if you want to highlight and contour, you can actually play with the shades a little bit. This one's going to be slightly lighter than her skin tone. Shake the can a little bit in the, in the palm of the hand. You can see, obviously, that is a little bit lighter than her skin. And I'm going to go under the eyes with this and just right underneath the eyes. And I'm going to bring it all the way out across her cheekbone. And that's going to give me a really beautiful